Okay guys, Akumalo Crypto here with another Bitcoin update. Um, so picking up for, from where I left you guys yesterday, right? Uh, I proposed this triangle here inside of this B wave here, which seems to be, it's, uh, I think that now, by now, we are pretty much uh, we, we 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 can say with confidence what's going on, right? What was going on? This triangle here, this formation here, was a triangle that had that had the E wave here at this price here, this top line here. This it, it was like six five hundred, and then we started going down. We broke. This was the the end of the triangle. Okay. If we mark some trend lines here, uh, marking where we started triangle, it's here. Yes, that's it. Something like this. This is two hours chart, so I'm just disregarding those weeks here, but it's pretty much, this is the bottom line. And we have the upper line here. something like this okay we don't have three uh, three touches but it's enough just the shape of it okay we have a wave, wave B here the C is rather complex and then we have a D and an E wave here and down we went and down we go right now it seems to me that we are finishing this first wave going down to complete this C and to complete the Z wave, okay? Z wave of the overall picture, which is this picture here, which is this count here. If you have been following me, oopsie, let me take this out. Um, if, you have been, if you have been following me, you, you, know, you, you, you know this count here for a long time, right? This is my primary count and I, I don't have a second. I don't have an alternate count actually. I think that I, 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 what I do is I react to the market when something goes differently than I was planning and I react to it, okay? And I, of course, I mark the, the resistance that we have, I mark the support and I keep, I, I keep labeling. But some of my marks here have been so, for like one year, okay? We are now one year in this, in this uh, correction, right? So, um, as I said yesterday, we would find support here. Well, this support here is not a support any, any longer, right? This is now a resistance, okay? This is the 6,000, 6,100 region, okay? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna mark it as a resistance because oopsie that's what it is okay it, it was a previous support here it's now a resistance it's gonna be a, a key region for us resistance okay um this is our resistance now remember it has been a, a really key region for us for all the uh, if we if you just if we if we look at the left side of bitcoin here but less left side of the chart we pretty much can tell how supportive this this region was and now we broke with the confidence through it so who are so strong now um i i don't know who are so strong uh, who, who are so strong bullish now i, I don't i can't see how you can be a, a bull now because Upon breaking this resistance here, it's down here is, uh, you see, we will we, we, we find some kind of support here. Okay, which is, by the way, where I marked here, minus 618, 786% of the whole movement. This would be a, a one stop for Bitcoin if we stop here. This would be 4200. Okay, if we use our FIB extension from this stop here where is the beginning of this A wave here and projecting through B here. Look where we find the targets. 100% is here. Remember I said yesterday, 
4700 would be a target so guess what we have here 100 percent for our abc and here we have the sweet spot 127 20 percent for our wave for our abc as well right so we have both targets we have this one here this would be roughly 40k if we break if we break 4k in the man then we have this cluster here that would be 3k here 2k but i don't think we're gonna get here this cluster here I, I won't talk about it now but i think that this support here is gonna hold first if this is strong support which is the the five 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 two hundred right this one here I said yesterday, yes, we would uh, we would find support at the at the 5200. Is a this is a strong support here now, okay? If we break through it, then we we have this 100 here minus 33, 20 percent here. This is another uh, another support here. So we don't know exactly where it where it's gonna stop. Where uh, we don't know. We have those targets and don't be a bull now guys okay don't be a bull don't be a a bull in a bear market i <laughs> i have been saying this okay don't be a bull in a bear market don't don't learn how to trade only in in bull markets you gotta learn how to trade in bear markets okay so we have support here and we have a support here as well oopsie okay so that's pretty much i think that i don't see a reason why we won't go to those targets here 4700 and we are gonna see 4k okay i don't see why we won't do something like this uh this would be the first wave then the second then a third wave perhaps touching it here and then something like this an ending diagonal for this uh Perhaps we would see some kind of a week going down here, and then we will we'll see, of course, the market picking up when we get to those levels. So it's actually uh, we we might just be finishing here the correction, but it's difficult to to say that. I I don't I don't know what you guys what you guys think about it. Some people might think about I don't know that we are gonna finish upon touching this 5200 5, I, I think that of course you're gonna have a reaction upon trying to break below 5k but this this might be just the wave two the the the, the reaction the the second wave and then okay this wave here we touch the 5200 we react then then this is a resistance a previous support acting now as a, as a resistance then we go down all the way breaking this support breaking then 100 percent of the extension here and then going then a reaction so previous support now then will be a resistance then going down again this is a, a pretty nasty bearish count but it's it's on the table okay we broke this last line of support and now it's a resistance see guys this is undeniable that we bro we broke it with confidence this has been holding this whole movement down here for pretty much the whole year so we are indeed in a bear market okay don't forget this is the weekly chart we have a cross here macd we have this cross here that i brought you guys to attain i brought you guys attention to this cross here the 21 ema crossing the the 55 ema it has never happened before we broke here with confidence the 100 ema okay so this is another bearish sign and we broke through we broke this is a breakout this is a break out of this triangle here that has hold the whole bitcoin the whole movement since the since december last year so all the data we have it's uh it's showing us that yes it's a bearish it's a it's a uh, it's a breakout to the downside and it's not over okay uh, here we have uh, this is bitfinex but we have all the targets that we might see i 
I start doing this with the 50 percent. I don't. If you have been following me for some time, you 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 may have uh, you may you you may remember me saying about this uh, chart here. 50 percent is always present, and then I said, remember, guys, that this wouldn't hold any longer because it, the, the 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 amount of time that we spent above the 50 percent was decreasing until we have this decisive movement here and then we broke down and then we have all those targets here okay plain of all targets point to this region again the same region guys this is the region of the 5200 okay then we have another region here this is not me it's the algos right talking about the uh, uh, planning to sell at the 50 percent here and buy again at at those targets here it's where it's where we are gonna see some kind of reaction so this is the 4700 target that I said yesterday and then we have here the 4200 you have another another target here another cluster of targets here okay another one here 4200 4k okay I don't think I, I, I I can't say that this is gonna stop now and that's it uh, it's it would be really optimistic to say oh it, this is just a, a a dump and then we're gonna go up if if Bitcoin does so I'm gonna be really surprised but it's uh, I'm gonna react to it but uh, I, I won't I won't count on it okay I think that we are going we need to finish this ABC here okay this a B C here to finish this Z and we are now in this C wave here we have been we had we had been in this A B C D E for 60 days okay for the whole September and October going sideways and now we are going down okay guys and uh, this is bit stamp two hours okay the same count A B C and then we have this A B C D E here is the the breakout okay we might have finished this uh one two three four five here the first wave here we might okay 30 minutes here if we take a look at this i think that we are in the process of finishing it and probably we are gonna touch the support here okay we are touch we're gonna touch the 5200 perhaps we're gonna see some kind of uh, touching to the 5k okay the downside breaking the support here and then we're gonna see a reaction this is gonna be our wave one this is our wave one wave one then two three four five sorry for the it's not symmetrical but let me this is, let me put two hours again okay something like this again the same targets here guys okay same targets the story is the same so we're gonna test this support here the, the this resistance here this is wave this would be a wave two then wave three is gonna be the longest might be the longest we don't know yet but then we are gonna see something like this to the 4k right i am looking at these targets here so let me mark it for you guys we have this algo target here Minus 3320, minus 3360 percent. Okay, this is a support. So this is where I think wave three is gonna is gonna land, prob probably. Okay. Um, wait, wait a second. This is also support here. Okay, this is roughly uh, 4700. As I as I said yesterday, it's gonna be a target. Okay, 4700. I expect we to I expect Bitcoin to stop there and then we have here the 4200 4k okay another target here for us okay another support here this might be the end of wave 3 4100 and then perhaps we go lower than 4k I don't know it's impossible to know now, but what I can say, we have a, 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 a target here, minus 618 of one of those movements 
of uh, probably one of the oldest moves moves here but I, I, I'm disregarding it because it's a uh, 3200 okay 3k we would go to 3k it's not impossible to imagine a 3k target now a 3000 target now it's not impossible we must find first of all we need to expect some kind of uh, some kind of resolution for this first wave then we would see some reaction this is the oldest the the previous lowest point of the year I think yes this was no, 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 that's true. It, 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 there, it, there it is. It was 5,700. So I expect it to be now a resistance here, okay? A uh, strong resistance. Okay, this is a resistance. 5,700, okay? Resistance. And by the way, the, this wave, this wave, this, the, pre, the, the current wave 4 has tried this resistance no it hasn't if we take a look clo a closer look no we haven't touched it okay we tried we, we had a, a a shy reaction which i i am uh, labeling wave four now and down we are going again for to complete this wave five here okay and to complete the first wave of this whole structure wave c okay and waves and wave C and to finish with with uh, finish this wave Z here of this triple combo here W X Y X and Z okay um, so far this is what we this is what I can tell you guys okay uh, we are approaching the end of this first wave and then I would if you guys are if you guys are in a short I would recommend taking profit now and re uh, and shorting it again when we upon touching this resistance because we are gonna see some kind of uh, reaction of course this is natural it's always up and downs so we're gonna see a, a, a reaction which which I'm gonna call here wave 2 and then we're gonna see a huge dump going to this 3 4 here and 5 okay I don't see a clear sky. I don't see anything like that. I just see a bear market. And that's what it is. Uh, for the whole... And, and 2019 is going to be a bear market. Again, guys. I, I, it's going to take a while to, to solve this thing here. To get to those targets. It's not going to happen tomorrow. So bear in mind that if we see some kind of reaction, it's normal. Oh, it's it's the end of the bear market. We see some movement like this. Um, I'm sorry. We see some movement like this. A, a really deep wave two, and then people will get dumped here because a wave two, a really deep wave two is gonna be expected because the market's gonna try to to kid us, to to confuse us. Okay, so pay attention. Okay, guys. If, if we finish here touching the 5k 5200 okay we are gonna see a strong a strong reaction trying to get to do, to 6k okay P perhaps breaking this resistance here okay and then we are gonna dump again what is important guys now is that we broke this resistance here this support here with confidence okay this is what I this is it's undeniable okay we are in a really we break out of this formation here in and, and we are in the downside here we are seeing we are expecting those those targets down here okay so um thanks for watching guys and give me a thumbs up if you like my content and subscribe to my channel and if you haven't followed and if you haven't joined us in our crypto trader crypto trader educational institute our discord server free discord server please uh, the link is in the description join us and if you haven't followed me on social media on twitter please consider doing so uh, i'm always presenting different uh, alternatives there i was trying to give you guys and to, I, i'm always trying to, to keep you guys updated Okay, thank you very much. See you guys later.
Cheers. Bye-bye.